Hello and welcome to Kerbal Space Program 019 and we can see the new face animations with Jebediah laughing his head off while he is descending back to Kerbin and he is laughing even when he is starting to burn from the re-entry effects and I don't know if Jebediah is brave or if he's just stone crazy or maybe he's just stoned actually but yeah, he's going at supersonic speed, even before he hits the ground, Jebediah is still laughing. So for some more re-entry effects, we are now deorbiting the Dragon capsule from our space station. And I know this is not a stock part, but the Dragon capsule looks absolutely magnificent and I wanted to see it as it entered the atmosphere with the new re-entry effects. And this was a low Kerbin orbit so we don't enter with too much speed to decelerate so the flames are not that great. But we go over to see some of the sonic effects in the game now. You can see some white smoke or white vortex on the end of the rocket and we can also see it better on this big rocket we can see the shock uh, wave effects the supersonic effects on the rocket and to show you that um, the di different Kerbals have different reaction Bill is now demonstrating that he is not as brave as Jebediah because before he's, he hits the ocean he gets a little scared and sad and is afraid he's going to die and yes, of course, the rovers, the beautiful, wonderful rovers. Well, my rover is not beautiful, I will admit that this looks absolutely horrible, but I had to throw something together. But the Kerbals didn't want to stay on the ride, so I threw them off and went for a ride on my own. And there is three different types of wheels for the rovers, the small ones, the medium sized, which are these, and you have the big tank wheels and the wheels can actually puncture as of now and to fix your wheels you have to send a Kerbal over to your rover to reinflate and change the tire in an incredible speed which you and I only could wish we could do when we get a puncture but yes that's how you fix the tires with a Kerbal at the side of your rover and the rovers are electrical powered and can get you up to a certain speed and they turn around the mass of the object you can also lock wheels uh, the steering on different wheels and the runway has gotten landing lights for night landing which is beautiful And finally to the thing we all been waiting for, to see me deorbiting a space station. And this is the space station from Kerbal Space Exploration. Uh, and we can see the flames starting to lick around the space station now, any minute as it's heating up in the re-entry of the atmosphere. And this has such a high speed that it actually took one and a half minutes to stop burning and there are the flames just coming around the space station licking all the parts and heating up and with the new night side of the planet with everything much darker the flames are so much more visible well we couldn't see the flames before but they are so visible with this all new dark side of the planet and the space station looks so beautiful while burning up so I will be quiet from now on and I also included a um, replay on the end I hope you guys enjoyed this please like and subscribe any question just post in the comment section wearing storm signing off